if you create a space which enables people to think and thrive, mm -hmm. that's a bonus. Um, before I started working officially, mm -hmm. I used to do a lot of freelance work. Mm -hmm. And as a young freelancer, my laptop was on my back. Mm -hmm. And I didn't have a, an internet connection. I didn't have an office desk. Um, it was difficult for me to work at home. Mm -hmm. So what I did is I would go and sit in a restaurant, buy some tea or breakfast, and ask for a Wi-Fi password. Mm -hmm. And then I would sit there and have my breakfast slowly. <laughs> <laughs> you know, as, as, as I, I did yeah. my work and I sent work to clients yeah, and everything. Yes, yes. You know, but before long, it, lunchtime, mm -hmm. it would be lunchtime, mm -hmm. you know. And they would, bring, to eat also. And they would bring a lunch menu. <laughs> <laughs> you see what I mean? Yes. So, so when you find a, a space mm -hmm. where people can come and sit mm -hmm. and pay for a full day. 10,000, I'm told. Yes, yes, you see. It's, that is creativity. Yeah. Because the owner of this building or the owner of this space knows mm -hmm. that people, there's a, there's a certain segment of the market that yeah. can't afford to rent a premises yeah. per square meter yeah. or 10 square meters or 100 square meters yeah. Yeah. And, and, and pay monthly yeah. and bring their own furniture, their own internet connection, carpeting, yeah. Yeah. light and everything, a working bathroom and then lunch for, for staff members. Yeah. So they think about it creatively and they say, how many people can this space take? Mm -hmm. 100 people per day. Okay, good. If each of those people pays 10,000 per day, and they come and have access to the internet and a nice chair and a desk yeah. and a good environment where they can concentrate and deliver. Yeah. That is brilliant. That is creativity in the workplace.